Hey guys, what's up? It's both here with Noli, and welcome to Lost City of Vampires. This game was sent to me by the developer of WRF Studio. Uh, this is a solo game that they've created, well, that he created, and I'm going to be trying it out. So, the first thing I already realized is that he's using a Paragon asset. This character is called a Revenant, and it's from like the old Paragon game. That got shut down because it didn't have like, enough players or supporting funds. So yeah, they released their ad sets for free. But here's my standpoint on ad sets. I don't mind if people use them. At least try and change them to where they look unique to your to yourself. You know, the game you've created, you, you have to have a unique model and not a model that everybody will recognize. And that same goes for the map. I recommend going into like I recommend personally going into like art design and stuff like that if you're like very serious about creating a game for sure just because if you create your own assets it's more unique and people will get into it more but from what I know about this about this game is on Steam it says sit by the council to hunt the lost city faction you must destroy the entire bloodline and put a end to a... Basically, you're just killing vampires. Let's just say that. <laughs> it's a single-player battle royale shooter challenge. It is not re yet released on Steam, so I'm guessing they he does need feedback. And he asked me not to like... Well, he's looking for people who don't like over-edit their videos. Which I can perfectly understand because I personally don't like over editing my videos anyway so I do feel you on that one will so yeah no no problem no problem I, I know it's not a triple-a game but I do want to keep like open mind and I do recommend that anybody else watching this video do keep an open mind give some feedback on how they feel about the game once I play it and you know ju yeah just basically keep an open mind with me so let's go ahead and get started we're level one we have no matches played we're in green lands so let's get started. Okay, one. The weird sliding. Alright, so I have to tap every time. Oh god. Okay, so all of them are Paragon models. I'm not a huge fan of uh, this being on my left side. So this is a single player battle royale, huh? Go to Hound. So are these guys even trying to kill each other? That's a real question. The storm is coming, so I don't have a map or anything, also. How do I get in the house? Okay, now my character is invisible. Okay, here we go. So I have a stick bomb. <laughs> Alright, so that's like uh, HP I can pick up. So you guys can already see a couple things that is wrong with the game. It does have like little graphical errors, stuff like that. Oh god, apparently there's an underground bunker. That leads me to a shed over here. That's pretty neat. I don't even know where the circle is. So that's not a good thing. Okay, so my auto, my ammo is down there. Good thing I chose not to take face cam with this. So how do you even tell? Hold on. Are there any key bindings for the map? Okay, the map is shown by tab. Oh, okay, so I'm good. Screw off, dude.
But so far, I can say, um, eh, not a huge fan. But this is probably your first game, maybe. Uh, let me know if it is your first game. If you have any other games that I can uh, take a look at, because I don't mind helping you getting some feedback on like these type of games. Um, I just say asset flipping definitely not the best way to get players. And you said you're going to be selling it for probably around five dollars. Personally, I don't think it's worth that high, especially since. Okay, dude, go away. Especially since the assets are not made by you. But I'd say the max would probably be like at least three or two dollars. That's just me personally. You can go whatever price you want to go with it. That's that's just my personal standby. Uh, if anybody else have any like price range of how they feel about it, go for it and post it in the comments. It'll definitely help them out. Like I don't mind helping developers, to be honest. Especially like small developers going, making our own games. Get off me, dude. Jeez. Alright, so we found armor finally. Oh, so there is a ship. What? Damn, dude, I'm fast as fuck. Okay, so there's another bunker. Got some armor. So the AI is not smart at all. They don't really go for each other. They don't go for anything else. So it seems like it's a very, very easy game from that standpoint. The only enemy that you actually have that is worth a threat is... Um, Is a storm. How how did you even? Okay, <laughs> I don't know how you died, but all right. Okay, uh, I'm not sure what just happened there, but all right. W what if? That, that's the thing. Find more ammo quant. Okay, I see. So I need to start getting within the circle. I'm fast as fuck, boy. I don't even have to worry about it. My bad. I tried to get my uh, steam down. <laughs> hey, who the hell is attacking me? Dude, do you not... You don't want these hands. Get out of here. Oh, God. Double team. Get headshotted, boy. But I'm, I'm kind of happy that you you kind of put it into Paragon uh, assets because I really did enjoy Paragon. But yeah, from from this point on, it's probably best to make your own assets. Just say it. And the running animations kind of need to be tweaked tweaked a little bit too. Just have my character slide across the world. <laughs> Like, I, don't, I don't mind the speed, it just needs to be, like, reworked a little bit. Damn, dude, you're fast as fuck, too! Headshot blocked. How did how'd you even block the headshot? Like, an idea like this is not bad, to be honest. Locked requires a key. Where the hell did you... Would you even find a key? Oh, don't run now! <laughs> oh, so now everybody's running to me. Well, you guys must not really have armor at all. But yeah, if you're gonna label the battle royale, it definitely has to be like, um... Oh. It definitely has to have your enemies looking around for like gears and stuff 
You got it so you can like shoot it off them. If you can figure that out, that is. I know there's a lot of complicated stuff when it comes to like when it comes to like making games for sure. Okay, so they just so you basically respawn all the enemies. And what's the point of the storm, man? Just for me? What the what the hell? I see how it is. Okay, so that keeps me from attacking. Thank you for the arbor, dude. Really appreciate it. I hate that I have to click every time. I normally like to hold my clicks. Alright, time to start wasting ammo. Warner Circle. I have plenty of HP around. That's, that's something I can say. Oh, energy jump? Okay. Oh god, these guys take a lot of HP. I was curious about that. So that shows all enemies. I want my ring back because I, I can run out of ammo pretty fast. So I wanted to use this. So, dear god, um, okay. Oh, so you can't really jump out there. Yeah, not fair to you guys, is it? <laughs> I can just see you on the map. Get out of here. I'm gonna take this instead. I wonder, does it give me more now that I have two rings? Ha ha ha. Yeah, I'm still in the middle. I'm good. Let me go grab these. I think I, I don't know if it actually does. Ah, oh, there they are. Thank you, appreciate it. Now I heard you coming from like a distance. Not today. Nope. I'm fast as fuck, boy. Dogs are easy to deal with. I just gotta deal with these guys. Those are range attacks are probably the worst ones to deal with right now. Appreciate it. Now if your aim was terrible, you probably lose. <laughs> Through that, you're gonna have to go find ammo. Kinda curious what the storm looks like. I didn't even realize we got stamina. Really, dude? Come on. Die. I saw that game.
That armor? Yep. Oh damn, wait, hold up, did he explode? I say, are you okay? Well, double kill. Thank, thanks, dude. I don't, I don't know why you ran into that, but all right. So 26 people left. Seems about easy. Dead bodies. <laughs> what are you running for, huh? Trying to get something over here? Oh, these are mine. No, I could heard you from like a mile away, dude. Come back. They just bowed up like pretzels. <laughs> I'll, I'll give my uh, final opinions and um, like personal price of what I would personally play. What I would personally pay at the end of it. Get off me. Oh, so now you guys gonna run like little pussies? Not today. You're not taking me alive, dude. My high ground now, boy. I have not been paying attention to the circle. Oh my god, not again. Whoops. I may have screwed up. <laughs> my scene came up and I couldn't see and I could have frozen the game. No! Only had 15 players left, dude. Feels bad. Feels freaking bad. It seems like um, Steam, me closing on Steam kind of broke it. So that's not good. That's not good at all. So I think that's pretty much the end of that. Damn. Uh, I almost won, too. Almost did it on the first try. Feels bad. But yeah, guys, I'm going to end it off there with that. <laughs> that sucks. But how do I feel about the game? Eh, not the best one in the world, but I guess it's a kind of interesting idea if the AI was like a lot smarter and actually like fought each other. And if you could actually get them to fight each other, that is. And if they were actually able to pick up items, you know, like normal AIs, sort of like that. But it's interesting that you got them to at least move around. It's sort of like a wave game. Just stay in a circle wave type of game. I wouldn't say like too much of one of the battle royales that I would ever, ever buy. If anything, personally, I would buy it for like $2 personally after playing it. That That's personally just me because it's nothing else here off of this, you know? But a few things that could be worked on if you are planning on releasing this game. Uh, first things first. Well, now no, let's give you advice on another game if you actually ever start up another game. Um, try, and commit, try and create your own models. At least try, you know, dazzle in a little bit, test around. It, it will help, definitely helps and you gain a lot of experience from it. And that actually helps you with like other type of like things. If you ever decide to go with a team, you know, and later on down the road, you will have some experience inside of like creating models and other teams will ever will be able to take you in or you can hire other people to join you on the road. But as for now, if you're planning on still being a solo dev, I do recommend just dazzling in a little bit of like editing when it comes to like models. 
To be honest, this could be like a great idea. Don't get me wrong. It could actually be like a really interesting idea. It just needs a lot of work. The AI needs a lot of work. To be honest, if you have like a lot of unique things, a lot of people a lot of people would play it. And I never really thought about like a single player battle royale either. <laughs> Until I you know just played it. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna count this as a victory, because I was doing good, damn it. It was just Steam and the whole tab thing. That should be changed the map also. The um, storm map. Yeah, that should be changed to M. Not tab because <laughs> tab and shifting at the same time does not work. As you saw, I kept going into Steam twice now. Especially when I want to look at the map and keep mobile. Yeah, probably not the best button for that. But... Yeah, guys, that's pretty much all I have to say. Um, Dev, if you have any other questions for me, I will answer them. If if you ever need uh, anyone to check out your games again, uh, I am available. To any other dev developers out there, I am available to check out your games. But it really depends on what it is. Um, I chose this one just because eh, it seems a little bit interesting. And plus, they, he genuinely came at me with a normal message and not like a, you know, one of those pre-made messages that I get most of the time. But most of those games are things I'm not interested in. If I don't message you back, then I'm probably not interested. Normally, I do message people back and tell them I'm not interested or I haven't been in my emails for a while. So, yeah. With that said, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next one. Till then, peace out. Tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. We're gonna make it soon. Just keep pushing through. Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through. Cause what you got to lose?